Hello everybody, I'm back with another video. So today's video is going to be news about Netflix's decision to scrap the Kane Chronicles entirely, which I will say is actually the best bit of news I've heard in a long time. Um, so the reason that they could not do the Kane Chronicles was for the last two years they had been trying to come up with a script that they liked. Unfortunately, they could not. And um, I'm going to say that I was very concerned about a couple things that they were going to, might do with the series if they decided to turn it into a movie. And it deals with the one pet peeve that I've got, and that is race swapping. Um, characters because you totally change the face of the character to uh, yeah I'm sorry I thought somebody was talking so when we go and talk about I uh, talk about this especially when you have movies and TV shows and stuff like that is any time that you speak out against uh, popular forms of race swapping, you um, are always encountering pushback from people that support this, that don't see this as just another form of, well, being stupid. So, um, so, to hear this news, is good it's good but my big concern is if disney grabs it which they will because they do own the rights to purse jackson just because they published the books um that if they decide to do a k chronicles one that they are going to race swap the characters so for example is um if they feel like that Carter and Saudi Kane's mother should not be white, but should be black. They will change her authenticity to to say that she is black and not white, and then Ryden will have an excuse to why he did that. Hmm. Do you know how many interracial couples loved the idea that Saudi and Carter Kane's uh, family was interracial? <laughs> There was a lot of people that did. I loved it. I, that was what I loved. I loved the fact is that we had two children who were the children of an interracial couple. I thought that was just great. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. Loved it. That was the big thing that got me to read the books. Also, the fact is I love Egypt. Um, so, if Disney grabs it, grabs it up, and says, you know, we don't want this interracial stuff, so let's just make them black. I will literally cry. I will literally cry. And do you, do you even know about just how much bullshit that Raiden will get for that? So, uh, you're still a racist. You're still a racist, but you're just hiding it. Um, again, mm. yeah, you're racist and you're still doing it. You're still doing it. I will laugh. I will laugh. So, yeah. But I'm glad. I'm glad that Netflix is not um, doing this because you're talking about, you're talking about a pretty thick book. Um, but it's just, uh, yeah. <laughs> yes, this girl's very glad about that. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what exactly happens if Net, sorry, if Disney um, gets the Kane Chronicles, which they probably will because they do, they did publish it in their publishing house. And we'll see what happens. We'll see if we get a uh, if they race swap. Uh, Saudi Kane, if they race swap her mother um, and stuff like that. So, I'm pretty sure that a lot of people that 
or a lot of some people can say, oh wait, this is a lot different than Annabeth Chase. This is, you know, she's she has interracial parents, and you're getting rid of that. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So we'll see what happens. And um, yeah, I'm in it there by wishing everybody a happy Thursday. I hope all of you had a good one. I got a couple more days till I get paid, and I'm very happy about that. So, so happy about that. So I'll see you guys around. Bye.